So, you've forgotten your Wi-Fi password, huh? Well, let me start by saying that this happens to everybody, so you shouldn't feel bad about this. There's no need to panic. There's especially no need to panic because there's a pretty easy fix for this. As a matter of fact, there are a few different options in terms of finding out what your Wi-Fi password is. In this episode from Network From Home, I'm gonna be breaking down these options for you. I'm going to be detailing the different ways that you can determine what your Wi-Fi password is. The first thing you need to do is you need to find a device that's either currently connected to this Wi-Fi network or has previously at any time connected to this Wi-Fi network. Preferably, this will be a laptop or a phone. That's what I'll be showing you today, but a tablet would do as well. As I mentioned in these examples, I'll be showing you on my Windows laptop and on my iPhone how to determine what your Wi-Fi password is. You can follow similar steps if you have an Android phone or a Mac laptop, but these are what I'm gonna show you because this is what I have on hand today. Okay, for this experiment, we're gonna pretend that I forgot the Wi-Fi password to my wireless network nwfh-guest-2g. With that, let's start with my iPhone as an example. Okay, here we are on my iPhone. The first thing we need to do, we need to access the Wi-Fi settings for my iPhone. So first, we need to go to settings here. Let's tap the settings icon. I should mention that in this first example, we're going to pretend that this iPhone is already connected to the wireless network that I forgot the password for. So now all we need to do is just identify what that password is so we can use it for other devices. Now that we're in the general settings, we want to click this Wi-Fi icon here that shows NWFH guest 2G. Okay, the next thing we want to do, we want to dive a little bit further and get more information about this Wi-Fi network. So we're going to click this little informational button on the right hand side. Okay, from there you can see it shows the password, but it's all dots. It doesn't show you what that password is. So all I need to do is I need to tap that password. It's going through the facial recognition. If you don't have facial recognition, you'll be asked for your password to verify you are who you say you are and that you're the owner of the phone. And then as you can see here, the password is don't forget me. Okay, so that covers us if your iPhone is currently connected to the Wi-Fi that you forgot the password for. How about if this iPhone previously connected to the Wi-Fi network that I forgot the password for? What do we do then? Well, let's take a look at that example. Okay, let's say I know this iPhone has previously connected to the Wi-Fi network that I forgot the password for. What are the steps we need to follow to determine what that password is? Well, we follow similar steps to start. We want to first click this settings icon. As you can see here, I'm connected to a different network. I'm connected to NWFH slash 5G. So this is a different wireless network. Again, we're going to click into the Wi-Fi settings here. Okay, and rather than clicking the informational button to the right of this network from home 5G wireless network, what we want to do next is we want to click edit in the top right. Okay, I was authenticated again using facial ID just to make sure I should have access to this information. And then here's a list of all the Wi-Fi networks that this iPhone has previously connected to. So now at this point, what do we need to do? We need to scroll down and find the Wi-Fi network we're looking for, which is down here, Network From Home Guest 2G. You can see it plainly there. And again, just like we did before, we wanna click that informational button to the right of the network. This takes us to a familiar screen. We just wanna tap the password again, and there we are. Don't forget me is the password. Okay, so those are the two cases for the iPhone. Now let's go into my laptop and follow those similar steps. All right, now let's follow the same exercise, but on my laptop. In this first case, as we'll see, if I go down here to my current Wi-Fi network, Network from home, guest 2G. I'm currently connected to the Wi-Fi network that I've forgotten the password for. Okay, so what we need to do here, we need to go down to this Wi-Fi icon. 
we want to right click it and click network and internet settings. Okay, as you can see from this information here, confirmation, I'm connected to the NWFH-Guest-2G network. In order to find out what this password is, we need to click this properties icon. Okay, in this window, we just want to scroll down a little bit and you see view Wi-Fi security key. And then we just click view. And there you have it. There it lists the password for the Wi-Fi network. Don't forget me. Okay, so let's close this and let's run the scenario again. But this time, let's make sure that the laptop is connected to a different network. And we're going into it with the knowledge that, hey, I know this laptop previously connected to the Wi-Fi network that I forgot the password to. So how do I find out what that is? Okay, as you can see here, we're now connected with my laptop to a different wireless network. If I go down here, NWFH 5G. So if we want to find out the password to NWFH-Guest-2G, again, we need to access these wireless internet settings. So we want to go down here, right click, network and internet settings again. Okay, and rather than clicking this information button to find out more about this current network, we now want to go into this Wi-Fi section where it says connect, manage known networks, metered network. So we want to click on that. The next thing we want to do, we want to click right here, manage known networks. And here, very similar to your iPhone, this will now list all the wireless networks that this laptop is connected to. So here we are right here, network from home, guest 2G. We want to click on this. And now we want to view the security key. Don't forget me as the password. There you go. It's as simple as that. Okay, so what do you do if you don't have a laptop or a phone that has previously connected to the wireless network that you forgot the password for? Well, thankfully, there's actually another option. It involves accessing your router settings, going in and literally changing the password for your Wi-Fi networks to something that you know so you can enter it into your other devices that want to connect to your router. I've previously made a video detailing exactly how to do this. So I'll link to that up above in case you're in dire straits and these first two options didn't work out for you. If you have any questions about these procedures or about how to determine what your Wi-Fi network password is in general, please drop a comment below. If this video was useful for you, I would appreciate it if you gave it a like. That way it'll get shared with other people that can benefit from this information as well. And lastly, if you enjoy the content on my channel and you get use out of the tips and the tricks that I provide, I'd invite you to subscribe to the channel. I'd love to have you along for the ride here. I'll be continuing to pump out more tips and tricks so you can get the most out of your home network. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Thanks for joining this episode from Network From Home. We'll catch you on the next one.